what? Why is he sitting like this? Who sits like that? And look at Lee, bro. Why they? <laughs> then you have Gara over here in a squatting position, about to take a mean, a mean doki. He in he in the boo boo position, bro. What is he doing, man? What is good with y'all? It's your ah! boy OG from the Vogue Clan, and we're back with another video. This time we are reacting to Naruto Unhinged episode seven point five. Rock Lee and the SVSC. What is the SVSC mean? I don't even. What, what does that mean? 7.5 is, is crazy too. He could have just said 8. But the video is just 6 minutes. So I, I guess I understand why it's 7.5. This is a filler. Let's just say it's a filler. So with that being said, I'm going to stop wasting your time. And let's get straight to it. I do not own Naruto or any other series related to it. This video is a parody for entertainment purposes and for the enjoyment of fans that follow the original series. But with all that said, please enjoy the video. Episode 7.5, Rock Lee and the SVSC. Disclaimer, everything said in this video are just jokes and not my true beliefs. Uh-oh, he had to give a disclaimer. People was actually getting upset. I know it, bro. Plus, it's not that deep. I'm black. Right, 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 right. If you thought he was white, bro, you tweet. What do you want? That first exam was pretty tough, right? Considering that it wasn't meant for people like us, I guess you can say that. You are right. Hmm. I like that you agree. Tell me, why did you decide to come talk to me? And why are you bruised? About one hour after the first exam, I tried to instigate two black guys into fighting. They realized what I was doing and started jumping me. You poor thing. It hurts me to hear that those animals would harm you like that. Bro, calm down. <laughs> those animals is crazy. Like, he, he the one that started it, bro. He instigated it. You didn't hear that? It is okay, though. I put them both in the hospital. Nice. You know what? I don't even need to know why you came over here. Just tell me your name. Mine is Gara. My name is Rock Lee. <laughs> why are you sitting well, it's like nice that? nice to meet you, Rock Lee. What, why is he sitting like this? Who sits like that? And hey, look at Lee. Bro, why they... <laughs> why they sit like... Lee look like he crippled already, bro. Look like he can't he can't feel his legs. Then you have Gara over here in a squatting position about to take a mean, a mean dookie. He in, he in the boo-boo position, bro. What is he doing? Rock Lee's eyes are misproportionate, too. That shit ugly. Rock Lee. Well, it's nice to meet you, Rock Lee. I want to ask you something, but I have to test you before I ask. I understand. Go ahead and start your test. I only need you to do two things for me. First, I need you to describe black people for me in five words or less. What? I can do that in four. I would describe them simply by saying, they not like us. Popular words from Kendrick Lamar himself. Kendrick Lamar? That sounds like a black name. I just thought of something perfect. I could make his crash out hit even harder if I make him think Kendrick Lamar is white too. Kendrick Lamar is not black. He is actually white. That's why. And he says the N word with no hesitation. He may sound black, but that's only because he wants to give those people a false sense of security. You should listen to him sometime. Yo. If everything you said is true, then I'll check him out. But let me move on to the last thing I need you to do. Say nigga. I will do you one better. He got like a weird, like, that sounded like he was like low key turned on by that. Like, it, like hearing a white person say the N word, he got real turned on by it. He said, hey, just do me a favor. Say, nigga. Like, bro, relax. I promise you there's more to life than hating black folks. Look, he thinking about it right now. Bar lyric. Sometimes you got to pop out and show niggas. Hmm. Pop out and show niggas. I like that. I guess you do gotta pop out and show niggas their place in society sometimes. <laughs> this Kendrick Lamar sounds like a white savior. I'll definitely check him out a now. A white savior is You wild. will not regret it. All right. I heard what I needed to hear. I want you to join the SVSC, which stands for the Sand Village Supremacist Clan. Oh, that's will what Will you join? Is. I remember now. I would love to join. All right. No way. Then it's settled. I'll let you be the Leaf Village branch of the SVSC. And since there are exams happening right now, there's a chance we might be put up against each other in a future exam. Ooh. If that happens, let's just play around and give those monkeys some type of entertainment. Wow. No need to risk an injury, which might cause one of our future superior generations to be affected. I understand you 100%. Wow. 
I do understand but, him, you know how that but just out. not in the okay. way he thinks I understand him. Because now I know exactly how to make him mad. If we get put up against each other, then that would be the perfect time to betray him and watch him crash out. Wow. All right. He's, he's the he's, little meeting to an end. He, he's I'll like, see you bro, roundly. He's in his big brain bag right now, bro. He's such an instigator. He's planning this whole thing out. Rockley ain't racist. He's only joining this and agreeing to this. So when they meet up, Oh, he'll force Garo to crash out. The level, the level of commitment to instigate shit is outstanding. I ain't gonna lie. That that's remarkable. That nigga Rock Lee different, bro. He a different type of ignorant, bro. No lie, no cap. I feel like destiny brought us together today. I cannot wait to pass this story down to the people at L Block. This crash out is going to be legendary. Wow. You've been standing here ever since you got back. Did something happen? Something did happen. Something good. Something really good, actually. But we need to talk about something more important right now. Okay, what do we need to talk about then? You know I love you, right, Gongro? You're my brother, and we share the same beliefs about those inferior beings. Yo, you this probably dialogue understand is me the wild. most out of crazy, anyone. Bro. Of course, Gara. I feel the same exact way. Well, the same in. can't be said about Tamari. At least not anymore. She's been changing a lot these past few years. Wow. And I'm starting to think she doesn't support the SVSC. I'm not gonna like lie. I've been noticing that. Yo, the, the foreshadowing. What like, bro, what you are in your bag. This is really good. Like, there's nothing much to say. Like, I just wanna like just let it rock out, you know what I'm saying? I thought she was just joking around at first, but I'm starting to think the same thing as you. Yeah. I thought that too. But after today. I realized she wasn't joking. What happened? Do you remember that light bright monkey we met the other day? Whoa. The one that always wears orange? Yeah. That the light one bright loud monkey that says nigga in every <laughs> sentence, right? Yes, that's exactly who I'm talking about. Okay, what about him? While you were at the bathroom, he started being loud and obnoxious, but no. somehow him doing that caused us to pass. It's still something my superior mind can't comprehend. But that's uh -oh. besides the point. No. Because after that, I looked over at Tamari and she had that look on her face. Oh no. Don't tell me it was that look. And I'm pretty sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. The same look You know she what's gave cool about this, bro? Now thinking about this, bro. Now I'm trying to figure out what's going to happen in the future episodes to come. Naruto and Gaara are going to have that fight. Right, they're gonna turn up, and he's going to change Gara and his racist ways. He's gonna convert Gara and his KKK white supremacist ways, and convert him into a nigga who like black folks. That's gonna be amazing. That's gonna be cool to see, bro. That's gonna be so cool to see. And then Rock Lee versus Gara. I wonder how he's gonna play this out. Um, haven't even seen have we seen a road tomorrow yet? I don't even think we've seen a road tomorrow yet. So it's gonna be crazy, bro. It's gonna be wild. Keep it pushing, bro. Keep it going. A half breed before she said she had feelings for him a few years ago. The one that we only accepted because he was only five percent black. She said she had feelings for him a few years. Ooh. Look on her face. Oh no. Don't tell me it was that look. And I'm pretty sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. The same look she gave that 6'4 half-breed before she said she had feelings for him a few years ago. The one that we only accepted because he was only 5% black. Which was very stupid of us to do, might I add. God damn it, Tamari! Why does she have to be like this? Relax, Kankuro. I need you to hear this. Until these exams end, we will not speak another word to Tamari. And when Dang. they finish, we'll find a fitting punishment for her. Dang. Does that sound like a plan? Mm-hmm. All right, then. That's settled. There's one more thing I need to tell you. One more thing. We have a new member of the SVSC. I think he has potential to go far in this clan. His name is... Rock Lee. Wow, bro. They about to be enemies, though. That's the thing. That's a crazy thing. He's making you crash out on purpose, Gara. You not seeing this? You not seeing this, bro? That was that was a real calm episode, bro. Um, dialogue heavy, but the dialogue was great. Like I I, I love the foreshadowing because, bro, 
you're you're literally taking everything from your previous episodes and like you're you're bringing it back full circle you know what i'm saying so bro this is this is real this is getting real good like i think like the story of it started to change i think around episode three like where it's like a consistent story and it's like spot on hey i'm fucking with you i'm fucking with you so look i'm kind of sleepy i ain't gonna lie this is my reaction to episode 7.5 it's your boy og from woke clan and i'm out